Hey guys, WWN here, and uh, I got a great video here. Uh, I'm going to be talking about uh, attacking and defending. We know that all three numbers, uh, attacking, offense, defense, and health, play a role. And we know defending is the same way. But somebody said that when you're attacking, offense plays more of a role. And when you're defending, defense plays more of a role. So we're going to test that and see if that's true. On the line, I have my clanmate and daughter who's going to help me out. Say say hi, Violet. Hello. All right. So what I have here is a gold. And uh, Violet, go ahead and put uh, a 1,000 Calvary T3 there. Okay. While she does that, I want to show you my, my skill tree. Um, so when you test this yourself, you want to make sure that if you have two fives, that both these mirror each other. You're not obviously you're not going to get the same results if your attacking and defense are different. So you can see that all mine are the same. So that shouldn't skew our uh, numbers at all. So this is going to be our baseline for attacking. Gonna send a thousand with my hero. All right, perfect. Gonna send these back. We'll look at this report. And I lost 352, which is it's a pretty good uh, first attack. It's almost right where I want to be at about 400, so we can look both ways. So now I'm going to put a thousand troops here. And Violet, I'm going to have you attack me with a thousand again. Okay. All right, and let's see if this number is the same. 352, 352. So that debunks that. Uh, as far as we know, uh, based on this test, all the numbers play a role and they all play the same role. There's no difference for attacking and defending. Uh, but we're gonna we're gonna rule that out. I'm gonna increase my attack and increase my defense and see if it changes anything. So now that we have that, I'm going to come over here and I'm just going to increase my offense. I'm going to try to get it as close to 50% as I can. So I know that this is at 3.5 and if I increase this by 45 points, it'll get to uh, up to 53. Alright, excuse me, not by 45 points, but by 30 points. But that'll give us an about 50% increase. And uh, we'll just do defense first. So I'm going to go ahead and put my 1,000 troops here. So let's go ahead and see what this number was. 296. All right. Go ahead and put a 1,000 Calvary there. All right. So now I'm going to go ahead and attack this. Attack. 1,000. All right. So exactly the same. Uh, I'm gonna say this is busted. I was gonna do. I'm gonna try to go ahead and do the rest of these, but I'm not gonna do attack and defense. I'm just gonna do them for uh, to decide which one's better um, on uh, 
on specific numbers on uh, when you do Calvary offense, Calvary defense, and Calvary health. Um, and then I'm also going to make sure that the bug is still there for decrease opponent's uh, defense. But uh, I can say that with 100% certainty, uh, your offense and defense uh, doesn't change your attack or your off or your defense. It's, it's all, all the same. So all the numbers play the exact same role when you're attacking or defending. Okay, I'm going to reset my hero. And then I'm going to go in here and uh, for my first one, I'm going to increase my cavalry defense. All right. 310, similar, close to the 296 that I got, but the numbers aren't exactly the same. I'm going to have to uh, divide these out to figure out their actual ratio. All right, so I'm going to uh, increase Calvary Health now by the same amount. Activate this, so everything's back to zero. And then just increase my Calvary Health. Three two ninety three. All right, and now I'm just going to uh, verify that the decrease health is still messed up. Or decreased uh, troop. So rather than waste uh, another activation ticket, I'm just going to increase this and uh, see if there's a difference from the 293. If we kill less, then we know that it's still messed up. One, we definitely lost more troops by increasing that. So we know that the bug is still in place. So the other thing I'm going to test here is I have a thousand cavalry here and I'm going to attack it with melee. I'm going to see how much of a difference melee relates to uh, your health and your your offense. So attacking with a 50% decrease. So I won, good, it'll give us good numbers. 240. All right, so I'm going to attack with a thousand scouts. Right, excuse me, it's a thousand range. Let's see where we're at with that. Five, six, that's huge. Uh, that's, uh, you know, tight crossing and uh, attacking their weaknesses uh, is probably the biggest uh, thing that we can do in the game. Uh, so uh, it's good to have those numbers so we can take a look and, and see that uh, the weaknesses uh, still plays a huge role. It isn't just like an extra 50% uh, health. It's quite a bit more than that. Um, it does, I mean, obviously you can overcome that with enough defense mods and offense mods, but if you're attacking an opponent who is equal to you at any point, um, having those, having the right type of troop attacking or defending is huge. So, uh, great to know. All right, so that's all I have for this video. Um, I'm gonna put this in the description as well. So this is what I think is the best way to allocate your troop points, your skill points. Um, doing your, your health decrease, your offense decrease, doing the bare minimum you can in uh, troop 
uh, defense decrease, and then doing your health two, your defense two, health one, defense one, and then going into your offense one and two, and then increasing your health and defense. All those based off of what troop you're planning on using the most of. Uh, and the reason why offense is so important compared to the others is just that you get a huge boost. You get almost 50 points for 30, uh, 30 of the skill points used. Uh, the biggest, some of the biggest things here is uh, attacking with the right troops and defending with the right troops. So being able to scout your opponent and attacking. Uh, doing an attack versus their biggest uh, number of troops for that type uh, is probably a huge advantage, especially when you calculate all, you know, doing the offense and troop defense uh, all for the right type. So uh, that's it for this video. I don't want to make it too long. I could go test after test for tons of stuff. So, hey guys, I appreciate it. Uh, I, uh, I get a lot of, of people uh, just saying thank you for, for this video and uh, wishing that I had done it sooner so they could have saved some money. So um, at least it's out there now. And uh, the more videos to come, I got uh, some of the works that are going to be about scouts and scout armor. So uh, pay attention to that, and uh, I'll see you guys on the other side.